author. Well, Joanne, as you know, a federal judge acquitted Stone and the other Hutari members last month, saying there was no evidence of a conspiracy to wage war on the government. For two years following his arrest, Hutari leader David Stone Sr. was locked up, and the FBI had many of his personal possessions. Today, agents returned a lot of Stone's military style training gear, documents, and other items. But the most important thing that Stone wanted back was his wedding ring. Stone's wife, Tina, had also been charged in the plot, and they were not allowed to communicate very much during the two-year ordeal. Today, Tina put the ring back on her husband's finger outside FBI headquarters in Detroit. Well, that's kind of nice. I mean, we didn't feel we'd done anything wrong, and it's nice to see that the government is complying and agree that we didn't do anything wrong and we're giving back our stuff. What was it like getting your wedding ring back? Excellent. Finally, after two years, that was excellent. Stone will not be getting his guns back because he pleaded guilty to a gun charge and will be sentenced on that in August. Stone says he's just starting to put his life back together, and he and Tina are planning to renew their wedding vows soon. They had been married only three months when the FBI arrested and separated them in 2010. Vic.